Hi, and welcome to the installation tutorial of your new Infinity F50 and the Magellan software. The 96 well plate absorbance reader is LED light source based and has a measurement range from 400 to 750 nanometers. The standard version comes with four filters, but you can easily install up to four additional filters. The Magellan software helps you to control your instrument and analyze your data. The Infinity F50 comes in a box like this one. Make sure you check for any damage when it arrives. Carefully remove the F50 from its packaging. The package also includes a power cable with a power brick, a USB cable and various relevant product documents. The USB flash drive contains the Magellan software and more operating instructions. If you think anything is damaged, please contact our help desk. Now we're going to show you how to install and register the Magellan Tracker version. The Magellan software is available in two different versions, Magellan Standard and Magellan Tracker. Plug in the USB drive and transfer the setup file to your PC. Open the Magellan setup file. Use an account with full administrator rights to install the software. Then simply follow the instructions of the installation wizard. Accept the license agreement. Enter your username and the organization. And click Next to save in the default file directory. Choose a language. And select the software version you have purchased. This will be either Magellan Standard or Magellan Tracker. Wait for the installation to finalize. Then restart your computer if necessary. Now you're ready to install the hardware. Firstly, assemble the power cable and connect it to your device. To connect to your PC, take the USB cable and plug it in right next to the power cable. The other end goes into your PC. Turn on your instrument with the power switch. The green blinking light indicates that the device is now ready to connect to a PC. After successful installation, open your Magellan software with administrator rights to ensure a successful registration process. First, we need to create an administrator. This step is only necessary for Magellan Tracker. Later, you can create and administrate users in the user administration. Note that Magellan Standard does not require a user administration. Make sure to remember your username and password. You are now ready to connect Magellan software to your Infinity F50. When the green light stops blinking, the device is successfully connected. To have full function of the Magellan software, you need to register it. Note that Magellan version 7.2 Service Pack 1 for F50 is the dedicated version for the Infinity F50 and doesn't need to be licensed. Follow the instructions of the registration wizard and when prompted, enter the serial number, which can be found on the plastic pouch of the USB stick. If you are a new user and do not have a license number yet, select the option to request one. Fill out the registration form. Continue to the next screen and click the View Form button. Magellan will open the form in Notepad, allowing you to save it as a text file. Attach this file to an email and send it to expertline at tcon.com. Once you have received your license number from Tekan, open the registration wizard and enter the license number into the appropriate box. This completes your registration and permanently enables the software for that computer hard drive.
You can also connect to your instrument in the Miscellaneous menu under Instrument Control. Now that you're fully set up, let's get started with your new Infinity F50 and Magellan software. To perform a read, you can either start the measurement directly or create a new method that can be saved and used for future measurements. First, we need to define the measurement parameters. Choose the correct plate definition for the plate you are using and the area you would like to measure. To perform an absorbance measurement, you can choose a measurement wavelength and reference wavelength if desired. New actions can be added to the method by dragging and dropping them from the menu on the left-hand side of your screen. Note that the measurement parameters are processed in a hierarchical manner, from top to bottom. For this demonstration, we want to first shake our plate, setting the desired duration and intensity, and then we can move the plate into the load position. You can also perform these actions over a time course by using the kinetic cycle parameter. With the parameters set, we now need to define our plate layout. You can define blanks, standards, or samples. You can also select more identifiers, like negative or positive controls. Once the plate has been defined, the concentrations of the standards can be entered here. We can use Magellan software to define data transformations, for example, a blank reduction. We can also use the standards we have defined to create a standard curve. And you can define cutoffs and QC validation criteria to easily discern differences between samples or to check for assay validity. You'll find that the Magellan software simplifies the way you manage your data. When each step is finished, you can save your method. Measurements are very straightforward with Magellan software. Firstly, put the plate on the carrier in the correct orientation. To run a saved method, click on the Start Measurement option on the main menu, and then select Run from existing methods. Choose the correct method file, and then click Start. The red light indicates that the measurement is proceeding. Magellan creates a workspace file after each measurement, where you can view and analyse your data. If you need further help, please find detailed instructions in the manual or on the USB drive. And please do not hesitate to refer to our help desk experts.